Daniel, I love and adore you so much. Since the day we met in Adelaide, you have been such a constant safe haven for me, bringing so much ease and comfort into our everyday life. You have forever made me feel like the only girl in every room, and I can't tell you how secure and loved this makes me feel. You make even the most uneventful moments, like grocery shopping on a Sunday, <laughs> full of genuine laughter and fun. I am so thankful for you and the love we share. You often say, I wrote the book on Tennille, <laughs> to which I usually roll my eyes. But I've come to learn you often know my thoughts and feelings before I do. Whatever our souls are made of, I'm certain yours and mine are the same. Daniel, you are kind, selfless and patient. You have shown up for me again and again without question. I want you to know I consider it to be my greatest privilege to be marrying you today. <laughs> I vow to love you, admire and appreciate you. I promise to make our marriage a priority, to empower one another to always dream higher and to build a home that is a place of refuge for us and our family. I promise to protect and defend you and be your biggest cheerleader in this life. I promise to banter with you always <laughs> and remind us to never take life too seriously. And lastly, I promise to never keep score, even when I'm clearly the one winning at mini golf. <laughs> it is a comforting thought that when we're old and gray, I know we'll still be pinching each other's butts in the hallway, <laughs> flirting like teenagers and speaking in half sentences because the other just knows exactly what the other is thinking. I used to think it was unrealistic to have a love and foundational friendship like my parents do, something I've aspired to my whole life but in you I have found my one, my bestest friend and true love. <laughs> 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 I gotta hold out.